Oh my God, I've been so gassed with this. Are you mad? And like a couple people been like, or corporations been like, let's do a lyric breakdown. I'm like, I'm saving it for Junius. I'm saving it for Junius. And we're here now, so that's so cool. Substance abuse discussed amongst women is such a like taboo subject to discuss, you know what I mean? Because it's deemed unattractive or messy. And it's something that, you know, I personally have battled with in, in my own way and have poured into this album and this music expressing candidly and explicitly because it's medicine for me, I guess. And Mike Sabbath, who EP'd the record, was one of my best friends. I remember he was playing this beat in the car. It was like the one song where the beat come first. And I was like, this shit is hard. And I was just in the car like, we went on a like a random road trip to Utah, like to some log cabin. I was like, oh, pull up that beat, like it's time to do this one now. And I went to the toilet and I was like, dear God, like help me write something fire on this beat because the way I'm connected to this beat, like just inspire me right now, amen. And then we went on the mic and it all just kind of fell out. Sleezing and teasing, I'm sitting on him. All of my diamonds are dripping on him. I met him at the bar, it was 12 or something. I ordered two more wines, cause tonight I want him. I don't know, you know when you see movies, yeah, and they'll start the movie from the middle of the story and then they'll cut it and be like, five hours earlier or like two weeks previous. Or like, I wanted to do that kind of moment, but in a song. Yeah, I just think it's fun to like break the story up. It doesn't always have to be told in order. A little context if you care to listen. I find myself in a shit position. The man that I love sat me down last night and he told me that it's over, dumb decision. Ray, what is it, dumb or done? Basically, I recorded it as done decision, D-O-N-E. And then Tia, shout out Tia. When I played her the first um, demo, she's like, oh, dumb decision, that's sick, I love that lyric. And I was like, oh, it's actually done decision, but I like that more, so let's just do that. I didn't re-record it, I was just like, let's just write it in the lyrics, and I'm sure it'll be fine. Yeah, but people always like, is it dumb, is it done? But it's, it's both. And I don't wanna feel how my heart is ripping. In fact, I don't wanna feel, so I stick to sipping. And I'm out on the town with a simple mission in my little black dress and the shit is sitting. You know, if you're going out on a casual night, you might do a little two-piece, jeans and a little crop top, but the little black dresses are coming out? Nah, it's, it's you know what I'm saying? You've got you've got a mission in, in mind. May just be an item of clothing, but I think it symbolizes so much more than that. Just a heartbroke bitch, high heels, six inch in the back of the nightclub, sipping champagne. I don't trust any of these bitches I'm with in the back of the taxi, sniffing cocaine. You know, I think it was for me like just flashes of their moments. You know when you're like going hard and you're just in spaces that you know you don't necessarily belong or feel comfortable or are necessarily safe like, and you have them like out of body moments like, damn, like I'm just here at the back of this club. Like, I don't know, nobody here, I'm liquored. You just like realize you're like, oh damn, this is, this is heavy. Drunk calls, drunk texts, drunk tears, drunk sex. I was looking for a man who was on the same page. Nice, nah, back to the intro, back to the bar, to the Bentley, to the hotel, to my old ways. I don't know what it is. Well, we all know what it is. When you drink a little bit of alcohol, yeah? Why does everyone who you shouldn't call immediately just burn at the forefront of your mind and you're like, I need to call them, I need to message them. But yeah, it's one of them ones in, in them moments where you've had drinks and then you're like, right, I'm ringing my ex, I'm ringing people for attention and for feelings. Like we're all victim of it, I think, when you know, you're going through it and you, you're liquored. Cause I don't wanna feel how I did last night. I don't wanna feel how I did last night, doctor, doctor, anything please Have mercy on me, take this pain away You're asking me my symptoms, doctor, I don't want to feel I'm good now and I'm blessed to say that, you know, I can even tell this story now But at that time I, I just wasn't and that chorus really is just a cry To just desperately plead to not feel reality in the moment that you're in, you know Talk this joint, how I'm blowing this steam. Back to my ways like 2019, not 24 hours since my ex did, did it. I got a new man on me, it's about to get sweaty. 2019 was a messy year. Yeah, it was. The wildest part is nobody nobody knew. Like, yeah, I was wild in 2019. That's why I said that. 
Last night really was the cherry on the cake, been some dark days lately and I'm finding it crippling. How I deal with them crippling dark days now, I would say, you know, keeping it clean for me personally and people and friends that keep it real with you, I think it's so important. And going home. When you're away from home for too long, you start acting crazy, go home. Go talk to your mum, hug your dad. Excuse my state, I'm as high as your hopes that you'll make it to my bed, get me hot and sizzling. If I take a step back to see the glass half full, at least it's the Prada two-piece that I'm tripping in. And I'm already acting like a dick, know what I mean? So you might as well stick it in. Ooh. I feel like that lyric to me just kind of sums up the energy of the entire song. And you're like, I'm acting like an absolute dickhead, like being not myself, talking like I'm not me, like all of this. I was just like, you may as well just christen the night with the way it started, mission done. Lipstick smudge like modern art. I don't know where the fuck I am or who's driving the fucking car, speeding down the highway, sipping. I'm mixing pills with the liquor cause fuck these feelings. I left everyone I love on red, mm -hmm. Spilling secrets to the stranger in my bed, uh. I remember nothing, so there's nothing to regret other than this 4-4 kick drum pounding in my head. I like to do like a detail, a location, a feeling, another like imagery. Um, just to like really set the scene, mixing pills with liquor was, is always a bad idea, never do that. I left everyone on I love on red. It's such a sad lyric and it was such a sad time where, you know, the people who really love you the most um, are messaging you like, are you okay, calling you right? And it's just like, you know, you're just like, nah. And, and I'm spilling secrets to some stranger instead. Like, it's just like, that's dark. It shouldn't be that way. You know, I remember playing my parents that song <laughs> for the first time. It was like, you know, but there was a period of time where I didn't see my family at all. Like I saw them like twice in a year. And it's when you're in the thick of those things, you're just afraid to talk about it, you know? But yeah, music is medicine and, and it makes it easier to have these conversations and say your shit in a safer place, right?